Here we go again with something unbelievable to show you. Today, let's talk about China's technological innovation and advancement that are at another level. The technological innovation and advancement from China you are about to witness are something you haven't seen before. Hi, good day to everyone. My name is Arthur and welcome back again to our channel. And if you are new here, be sure to subscribe and push the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our great contents. And without wasting any more of your time, here we go with my number one. Number one is China's smart base for gas equipment manufacturing. China's first smart base for offshore oil, gas equipment manufacturing has started trial operation in the northern Tianjin municipality. The base has adopted an intelligent manufacturing model and is equipped with an information-based system to manage production. The system can monitor production, track project progress, and realize quality tracing. The base started construction in 2019. Number 2 is Chinese scientists develop new quantum computer. Chinese scientists have established a quantum computer prototype named Duzhong 2.0 with 113 detected photons, achieving major breakthroughs in quantum computational speedup. In the study, Gaussian Boson Sampling, a classical simulation algorithm, was used to provide a high efficient way of demonstrating quantum computational speedup in solving some well-defined tasks. With 113 detected photons, Zhuzhang 2.0 can implement large-scale GBS septillion times faster than the world's fastest existing supercomputer and 10 billion times faster than its earlier version, Zhuzhang. Number 3 is AI Technologies at World's Voice Expo in China's Anhui. The World Voice Expo has opened in China's Hefei, exhibiting cutting-edge innovations in areas like smart city and smart education technology. China's leading AI and speech technology company, iFly Tech Company Limited, held the expo. Voice recognition is important for AI technology adoption in people's daily life. Number 4 is Giant Crawler Crane Rolls Off Assembly Line in China. A giant crawler crane has been delivered after rolling off the assembly line in Huzhou in China's Zhejiang province. The crawler crane produced by China's Sani Group has a lifting capacity of 4,500 tons, equivalent to more than 3,000 cars. The crane covers an area of around 4,200 square meters, about the size of 10 basketball courts. Number 5 is Metro Depot 
turns into solar power station in Shanghai. Shanghai has set a goal of being a model green city and located in Pudo, new area. The metro Luoyang Depot has been covered by solar panels. This project dovetails with the Chinese government's target of carbon neutrality in 2060. Shanghai is a home to more than 30 billion people. Many of the citizens here prefer to take the subway. According to the chairman of the board of directors, Shanghai Metro New Energy Company, the Shanghai Rail Network stretches for 772 kilometers and has 460 stations and more than 10 million passengers take the subway every day on average. Number 6 is China's first hydrogen fuel cell hybrid locomotive. The first China-developed hydrogen fuel cell hybrid locomotive started a trial run on a railway line for the coal transport in North China's Inner Mongolia Autonomous Region. The hydrogen energy locomotive project was jointly launched by the Inner Mongolia subsidiary of the State Power Investment Corporation CRCC Dato, and Hydrogen Energy of SPIC. Compared with traditional diesel locomotives, the new energy locomotive is expected to cut carbon emissions by about 96,000 tons a year, running on a 627km coal railway. Number 7 is Intercity Railway Line for Beijing Winter Olympics. The Beijing Zhangjiakou Intercity Railway built for the Beijing 2022 Winter Olympic Games has taken yet another major step toward full-scale completion of its construction. With a branch line linking two major zones for the Games, going into the phase of test operation and debugging in the start of the 100-day countdown to the Grand Winter Sports Gathering. And so, that's all there is to it for today's video. If you found this video wonderful, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.